Hello everyone. So today I am going to rename the image while uploading using PHP info. So basically PHP info is a function that returns information about a file path. So I'll be explaining that in a later section. So let me explain the steps. So first one I'm going to create a form for file upload and after that i'm going to create a db file in which i'm going to rename the file uploaded after that i'm going to upload that image into a folder and last one is inserting into database so these steps i'm going to follow so let's move to our first step that is creating a form for file upload so I'm right now creating index file, write basic HTML structure, give title image upload, write h1 image upload, create a form with method post and action blank, write n type multi part form data. After that, write input type file name. Name is going to be image and input type submit. So let's check our form in browser. Let's add some bootstrap styling to it. So open bootstrap CDN. Copy the CSS from there and paste the bootstrap CSS into head section. After that, copy the JS and paste that before the closing tag of body. So next, I'm going to add a class container. And next, define a div with class form group. Give input a class form control. And input type submit give class btn, btn primary. So our form is created for image upload. So now let's move to db file. That's our second step. So create image upload dot php file and pass that as an action in image upload dot php file check if submit is set or not if inside if get the name of the input file echo that and let's move to browser and choose a file in the form and click on submit image name is displayed so after that let's print temporary name and again check it in browser so our temporary name is also coming Let's now print path info and check it in browser. So path info is printing a array with four elements. First one is directory name, base name, after that extension and last is file name. So our image is break in four elements. So in path info you can pass second argument as option so from the four elements so i am just passing directory name as option so in browser if you will check dot is displayed so that's a now a string is displayed so you can fetch any particular option 
so I am going to fetch extension and store that in a variable because I just need the extension of the image to rename my image so after that define a variable rename write upload and pass current date and a random <clears throat> and a random number take random number in a variable after that create a variable new name in that first pass rename then write dot and last pass the extension that we stored in a variable so let's print new image name in browser and check it in browser so our new name is printing so last after that let's move to move file to folder so store temporary name of the file in a variable pass temporary name in move upload file second is pass directory that is upload folder and in if condition if file is uploaded then print uploaded else print not uploaded let's see it in browser refresh so it's showing one error so let me check okay so from the destination remove the backslash and now let's again check it's showing now uploaded so let's see in upload folder if our image is uploaded or not so our image is uploaded and you can see the name that is uploaded is the renamed one so so our rename part is finished now what left is inserting into database so for that create database with image upload name inside that create one table image upload and write column image id image name and status by default enable in sql get the insert query and remove the all the extra elements in dp file in uploaded val one paste insert query so for inserting the database we need a database file that will be having connection with the database so let's create a database file and connect to database with mysql like connect and pass all the arguments so first one is going to be server name local host then username going to be root password blank and last one is db name that is image upload After that display error for database connection if database is not connected properly include that file in my image upload.php after that pass the image name into the query and last one is execute the query using mysqli query so let's check it in browser refresh the browser and choose a file upload that file 
it's showing uploaded let's check in our table so one entry is there so it's uploaded in the database with the new name and if you will check in upload folder same name and file is also uploaded so let me show you another example if you have uh, two dots in your image name so that will be also uploaded and if I'll check in database it's having a new name and in folder also it's having a new name so if you have only two dots in your file name underscore or anything so that will also be renamed and your file will be same uploaded at both the places like in database and in folder so that's it for today i have shown you today how to rename your image while uploading so if you have any query so write down in the comment section so thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to my channel